All right. Would you clear your chat? <laughs> <laughs> you reread your chat and you cleared it. <laughs> That's a Freddy move. All right, guys. This is 2014 Bowman Draft Jumbo. Four boxer, number eight. These are the four boxes left from the case that I opened on Tuesday. And we had one colored auto in that four boxes. So I'm hoping we get two or three in this group, but you never know. That's my hope, at least. Tonight, we have Ricky with the Arizona Diamondbacks, T. Smith with the Braves, Ricky with the Orioles, um, Kearns has the Red Sox again, Barry's going for the Cubs, Maddox Man has the White Sox and the Reds, City Goat has the Cleveland um, Indians, Dennis has the Rockies, Allen has the Tigers, J.K. Shu has the Astros again. Sigari has the Royals. T. Smith has the Angels. Jerry has the Dodgers. Dennis has the Marlins. Uh, J.B. has the Brewers. T. Smith has the Minnesota Twins. Um, Jerry has the Mets. Ricky has the Yankees. Freddie has the A's. Uh, Barry has the Phillies. Uh, Vetter for Prez has the Pittsburgh Pirates. Um... Maddox Man has the Padres. T. Smith has the Giants. Dennis has the Mariners. Ricky has the Cardinals. Allen has the Rays and the Rangers. Ricky has the Blue Jays. And Barry has the Washington Nationals. Four boxes sold out. This will be our only break for the night. I'm wiped out of Immaculate until Sunday. I'm wiped out of a lot of things, actually. I need to restock for next week. A lot of new stuff coming out next week. So we're just going to open these four boxes, have fun, and then we'll probably watch another room or something. I think just about everybody in this break has broke with us before, so I think you guys know exactly how we do things. Um, we will get everything out tomorrow, shipping-wise. Um, and then Sunday night, we'll have a break. We'll do that separately. Maybe combine it with anything Monday night. Monday night, I'm going to do something with Bowman Draft. I'm not sure. Monday or Tuesday, I'm going to do something with Bowman Draft. I'm not sure yet. I might do a division break. I might try teams again. All right. You ready? Hey, Ricky, I was going to let you know, too, uh, on Immaculate on uh, Sunday night, I wanted to see if you wanted a team before we sold out. Um, you don't have to pay till Sunday, but I did have the Browns left, and I know you kind of like the Browns. So I wanted to offer you that to you before I dumped it in the store. Uh, the Browns are... The Browns are 95, which is uh, not too bad. They're one of the better teams. But... Uh, let me know on that. Otherwise, I'm going to start opening. I'm going to put the uh, the teams that I have not sold in my store tomorrow, probably around noon. So if you were, uh, let me know before that if you want them for sure. If not, I'll put them in the store. I do have some other teams too. So if there's any other team anybody's interested in, let me know. I got about half the teams that are unsold that I'm going to put in the store as of now. You want them? Okay. Let me do that right now then. Before I forget. I break key. <coughs> okay, thank you, sir. has a weird feeling tonight with mostly regulars, less people in the room that we're going to hit some big cards. Seems like this is every Friday night if you notice. Friday night's always more of our 
YouTube night. Especially early. Early. Well, early. Well, a lot of people, depending on what side of coast they're on, go out to eat on Friday night and stuff too. So, All right, pack number one. I don't think pack number one has anything special. I did tell you I won that NOAA last night, didn't I? Mm -hmm. 9510. Was it slab? Yeah, 9510. Tehran Guerrero for the Padres. Daniel Robertson Mini. Oh, they absolutely flew at nine per. NOAA's pretty strong. He's, I mean, that's not that far away from Schwarber if they're doing Schwarber at 1250. Yeah. But I think 1250 is too low on Schwarber, but. Dylan Davis and Tapia Refractors. I do too. Doesn't he fly at eight per on 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 uh, Grace? Do. Yeah. <coughs> I would much rather have it sealed up at nine five ten at twelve fifty. Dylan Cease, Silver Ice, auto number one is a base auto, red and blue, oh my god, Dylan Cease, I guess they put two of him back to back, Silver Ice and then an auto, that is for Barry. Tell him he's on the board with a Dylan Cease. He'll be excited. We don't have any boxes left for trash, do we? I can get you one. Yeah. I'll set it on the floor for now. Jordan LaPlau and Clayton Blackburn Refractors. Cody Medeiros insert. Got a red ice in this pack. Red ice in this one is Braxton Davidson for the Atlanta Braves. Braxton, pretty good prospect for the Braves. He's their top auto in the uh, set. This one's the red ice. Saboka and Ramsey refractors. And a silver ice. Of Eric Jagiello. <clears throat> Blue in this pack. Lift it up a little bit there, get it in the right angle. Not an auto. I haven't had a blue auto in a long time. Seems like I've had a lot tougher ones. I've not had a blue in a long time. Cardinals insert, and the blue is Cameron Varga for the Tampa Bay Rays. Reitz and Dozier refractors. Got an orange ice here. Orange.
orange ice is Michael Feliz of the Houston Astros. Got a Cubs Twins insert. I actually have sold a lot of this guy lately. Nice guy. Somebody came through and bought every single Michael Feliz I had in my uh, eBay store. Number 10 of 25. Jerry, did you get any news on your possible move yet? I haven't seen any Rob either. Antoine and Hoskins Refractor? He's supposed to have his interviews yesterday and today. Oh, really? He usually pops in a little bit later. Got a blue paper in this one. Here in Nola base card. Francisco insert, Jorge Alfaro mini, Tim Anderson blue paper. That's awesome. Oh, cool. So you getting all ready for the move? Scouting the casinos in the uh, Duke area? Giolito and Flaherty refractors? I don't think there is any. Uh, in North Carolina? I don't think there's anything in North Carolina. South Carolina has a ton of golf resorts. You'd think they'd have a few in there. On the, uh, it still would be a long drive, though. Any chance you can get, um, she be in position now to get basketball tickets? She's faculty. I'm sure she does. Yeah, Duke's a little tougher, though, because they give so many to the students. Yeah, it's a little tougher than here. Jonathan Holder, but I bet. I bet she would be. Or at least after a while. That would be fun, man. Yeah, it is a small arena with a lot of students. There's limited space. That's part of its appeal. It's smaller with the students on the side. Freely to Swartz Refractors. I bet you can get football tickets. <laughs> Money Harrison insert. Oh, this pack's backwards. Luis Servino insert. <coughs> Excuse me. Just base after that. Gatewood and Barrios refractors. Got a green here. We still, I've only got one auto, right? Yeah. It's going to be a green auto. It's going to be a green auto. I can. Got to be, right? It is. Green auto. What are those, 99 or 75? 99. 99. Okay. Our second autograph is the first color of this four. Hopefully not the last. It is a green auto. Of Luis Ortiz for the Texas Rangers. He's a first round pick. That's a nice one. I think that's Allen's. Allen got three teams. I think he is. Uh, that's a nice card for him. Number 29 of 99. He was the 30th pick for the Texas Rangers in the draft. Doug Brock is really high on him because he's a stud. Luis Ortiz. Yeah. Chapman and Frazier refractors. <coughs> and Ryan McMahon, Silver Ice.
Should have one auto left in the first box. You uh might want to text Dennis, let him know we're live. He might not know where. I sent him a text earlier. He never responded to it. Oh, okay. I thought he did. Zeomick insert. Just Doug did. Dominic Smith mini. Takar and Seeger refractors. Got a gold in this pack. It's going to be tough to get two color in a box. I have not seen that very often. You got a 50 50 shot here. It's you know? possible. Two packs left, right? This one and one more. Yep. Angels, Dodgers. If we hadn't got the green, I would really have a good feeling about this, but. Nope. It's Luke Weaver for the St. Louis Cardinals. Cardinals fan like that. That's a nice card. Ricky, you got the Cardinals? You do. Nice card there for Ricky. Go Cardinals. You'd rather have ink on this, but that is still a nice card. Um, that is number 35 of 50. He was the 27th pick in the draft. Should have an autograph in the uh, last pack. Honeywell and Lorenzen refractors. And Lane Thomas blue paper for Toronto. There's Alan. Alan, I hit, hit you an autograph in the first box. Got a base auto here. I'll recap the first box real quick. We had two people pop in. That's all right. Grand Holmes insert. We got a base auto here. <clears throat> Be a top tier name. Well, it's the Dodgers, but it's Jeff Brigham. Autograph for Jerry. Unfortunately, the other two Dodgers are really hot Jeff Brigham was the fourth round pick for the Dodgers still a hit though still a hit Holmes and Verdugo are really strong for the Dodgers I think sometimes the Dodgers don't get their due in this set Graves and Demerit Refractors. And David Dahl. Real quick, top loaders in the first box. We had a few of them. Luke Weaver Gold. There's the one I got for you, Alan. A green autograph of Luis Ortiz. It's a pretty nice one, actually. 29 of 99. Michael Feliz for the Astros. Uh, orange. Braxton Davidson Red. And Base of Cease and Brigham. Yeah, it was first round pick for the Rangers. All right, next one is going to be box two. Or number two. I numbered them on Tuesday when we broke the full case. This is the good one, Sigari. Hey, Sigari, Jason and I have a um, a Foster Griffin, uh, what what is it? Black Wave? Black Wave. Black Wave Auto. It's a little more expensive than some of the other ones that you grabbed the other day, but I was going to list it. I'm like, I should offer it to you first. If you're interested, I can get you a price. We've had it for about a three weeks or four weeks but I haven't got it listed it's a black wave um, 
I don't, what was it like? You know where it's at? I'll go yeah, it. it's in that long. I think it's nice, but I don't, I don't know if it's gradable. The black waves are tough. It's, yeah, um. Yeah, centering was the issue. With centering it. was? Yeah. You know where it's at? I'll go look at it. It's in that, <coughs> I think it's on the, um, table, uh, that's just left of where you usually put, put your backpack. It's in the long, it's in one of those, uh, long single row boxes. The black waves are tough though, Sigari, with, I mean, just the black color. It shows any white. Renato Nunez. Tyler Beatty. I think it's in perfectly fine condition. I just, I don't think it, I don't think Jason wanted to get it graded. Alex Verdugo and Peter O'Brien. Just the centering. Yeah. So the the edges are pretty nice on the black. Yeah, the edges are good. That's the only issue with the card is the centering. It might have an outside chance at a nine five. Then is it really bad centering? Yeah. Sixty forty. It's. It, yeah. Sixty forty. Yeah, I'll show it to you after a bit, cigar. If you're going to be around. Red Sox insert. Michael Setteroff, blue paper. Morales and heart refractors. <coughs> Gabriel Guerrero for the Mariners. Rob Kaminsky Mini. Gomber and Feliz refractors. Freddie actually bought the uh, A's in this break. Not sure why. He must like Chapman a little bit. Gatewood insert. Alex Jackson insert in front of an autograph of Michael Geddes for the San Diego Padres. It's a pretty decent one. He's, um, he's, he's middle to upper tier in the autographs in this. I would say middle. Yeah, he's about the second or third level. Second round pick. He does. He goes really good for a second round pick. But Verdugo is like a second round pick too. Yeah, Verdugo also, also batted like three eighty five last year. Yeah. Plus the hitters always go for more than the pitchers, and they're both hitters. Yeah. Morgan and Gonzalez refractors. Uh oh. And we're due for an Alex Jackson auto. Really are. Got a refractor auto right here. This is the second auto of this box. Got a Taquan Forbes Silver Ice for Texas Rangers. Grant Holmes insert in front of a refractor auto of Taquan Forbes. That's the second time we've had a silver ice where there was an autograph right behind it, the same guy. Nice card there for Allen of Texas. Texas has definitely been the best team of the break so far, easily. Got two parallel autos, a refractor and a green. Forbes, I think, is there another... No, he's second round, isn't he? Yep, second round pick. Cool. Congrats there. We got one more auto coming up. Jimenez and Reed Refractors. You know, we haven't hit in all the cases that we've done. We haven't hit a draft night auto. I know. We've never hit we've one. Never hit we've never, ever hit a draft night auto. They're very tough, but 
you think at some point I mean, we've hit supers got a blue here Hit plenty of purples, different time. Blue is Josh Hader for the Houston Astros. And the insert was Mets Mariners. Medeiros and Martin Refractors. Be fun hitting a redemption card for Barry too. Spencer Turnbull, Silver Ice, even though they're not all Nolas. Nick Gordon insert. Considering how hot Nola is, the Phillies that might actually be a little cheap. Nola in Montgomery Refractor. Base auto here. Behind the silver ice of Devers, who doesn't have an autograph, so we don't have to worry about that happen. Looking a little bit like a Rocky. Forced wall for the Colorado Rockies. That is Dennis's. Autograph. And he is round one supplemental pick for the Rockies. That is our sixth autograph of the break. Should have six more left. Grant Holmes and Foley Refractors. And the Deaver Silver Ice. We'll get some sort of parallel here. Super or printing plate or something different. Phil Irvin Silver Ice. Lucas Giolito Mini. Cozart and Sweetheart Refractors. Boy, the Phillies are really big on Sweetheart. He's a Red Sox, I thought. Yeah, the Phillies really want to want him in that trade. I think I think Mookie Betts is going to get traded to the Phillies. I think uh, them making Victorino the starting right fielder kind of gives you a sign that they think it's going to happen. Are they going to try and trade for who? Hamels. It's all Hamels, yeah. Right. No, tug this. I did sell the Bills. I do have um, a few teams here and there. I'm actually going to put them in my store tomorrow, but if you're interested in anybody specific, I, uh, there's some I could sell you, but the bills were taken. They went to the same person who bought them yeah, last I, time. Yeah. I do have uh, Michael Chavis insert. Medeiros insert. No problem. Um, if you want to check out, I'm going to put the remaining teams in my e in my store on. Um, let's see, it's Sunday night break. I'm going to try to do it like around uh, two o'clock tomorrow. You don't have my store address handy. You can plug in there, do you? He's going to drop it for me. If you want to bookmark it, if you want to see the teams left tomorrow, Ripken and Moran. And then we're only a we're only a week and a or a week and a half away from museum coming out too. Which I think will be fun. <clears throat> Jake Bowers insert. Yeah, I think uh I think they're just in love with getting that frontline starter. And I, I think Hamels is going to end up going to the Red Sox. I really do. After they lost Lester, 
Lucas Sims mini to the Cubs in free agency. Sheffield and Mondesi. I think the Phillies want Sweetheart and Betts. And I think the Red Sox are balking at Sweetheart part of it. That's the way it sounds like when you read the comments and Marlins insert. Jose Peraza die cut. You know Shane Victorino is not going to stay healthy long. Hanley's had a lot of injury issues too. Seems like he might be a little better playing in left field in Boston, but that lineup's going to be fantastic for Boston. Matt Imhoff and Jesse Winker. It's going to have to be because they're going to have to outslug everybody to win. Yeah, they don't have that great a pitching staff, but they have probably the best lineup in baseball. Or one of the top few. That's two boxes you want to open the other two? Sure. Jay's going to open uh, boxes three and four right now. So good luck, everybody. And we'll do a recap. Yeah, there's another player that could get hurt quite easily, a Sandoval. But they got so many big hitters. They even got hitters on the bench. Good luck, everybody. <clears throat> Sandoval's a big dude. I've seen him in person several times. You can show that to Sigari later, too. All right, I'll do box three now. Sandoval's a good guy, though. He, uh... Always took time to sign for people when I was uh, out there in Arizona doing spring training games. I like the guys that make time for the fans. I was really surprised last year how cool Joe Maurer was to us. He was super nice. I thought he was going to be kind of kind of rude, but he was really cool. Really nice. Took time to sign for us. Took pictures with us. All right, first pack. Chromes, we got a Schwarber and Gordon insert card. We got a Jake Bowers die cut for the Padres, not numbered. Remaining Chromes. Refractors were Mike Poppy for the Indians and Josh Bell for the Pirates. I didn't go to any uh, major league games last year, but I went to a ton of uh, ton of minor games last year. Had a great time. And I'll go to a whole bunch again this year, I'm sure. Looking forward to the Midwest League this year. Lots of uh, good prospects coming through the state. We have a Ryan McMahon insert card for the Rockies. Clint Coulter mini for the Brewers. Refractors are Taekwon Forbes for the Rangers and Raphael Devers for the Red Sox. Next year in the state of Iowa, we will have Nick Gordon playing in Cedar Rapids. We will have Alex Jackson probably playing in Clinton. Should have Chris Bryant for a little while. And uh, possibility of maybe uh, Addison Russell. I live in Iowa City. Ryan lives in Coralville. So we're about 25 minutes away from the single A affiliate for the Twins. 
in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. We got a draft night insert of Derrick Hill for the Tigers. A Bowman is back insert of Jamison Tyon for the Pirates. You know, I actually don't know uh, where DeWitt is at. I think it's relatively close, though. We got refractors of Nick Birdie for the Twins and Phil Urban for the Reds. Silver Ice of Nick Torrens for the Padres. Refractors, we got Kyle Schwarber for the Cubs and Troy Stokes for the Brewers. First auto in this this pack here. Looks like a base auto. Got a silver ice of Derek Hill for the Tigers. Draft night insert of Monty Harrison and the base autograph is Jeff Hoffman for the Toronto Blue Jays. First auto of box number three. A refractors of Alex Blandino and Mark Appel, Reds and Astros. Are you on Toronto, Ricky? Looks like it. Grats on the hit there. We got a Jordy Lara insert for the Mariners. A mini of Hunter Renfro for the Padres. Refractors are Derek Hill for the Tigers and Corey Ray. For the Royals. <laughs> Got a dual insert for the Reds, Nick Howard, Alex Blandino. Lance McCullers, blue paper. For the Astros, that's 122 of 399. Refractors are Joe Gatto for the Angels and Hunter Renfro for the Padres. Got a blue in this pack. Draft night insert of Michael Chavis for the Red Sox. Hunter Harvey Bowman is back for the Baltimore Orioles and a blue auto behind it for the Pirates. Trey Supic. 38 of 150 on the blue. Pittsburgh. Nice hit there for Pittsburgh. This 
second autograph of box number three. There it is again. 38 of 150. Refractors were Michael Mater for the Marlins and Gosuke Kato for the Yankees. Four packs left in this box. Got a Luis Severino insert for the Yankees. And a mini of Carlos Correa for the Astros. Refractors are Eric Skoglin for the Royals and Franklin Barreto for the Blue Jays. Got a Corey Ray, Silver Ice for the Royals, and a base auto behind it. For the Nationals, Jackson Reitz. Base autograph. That one goes to Barry. Should be all our autographs for box number three. Remaining chromes. And the refractors were Spencer Turnbull for the Tigers and Eric Jagiello for the Yankees. Got a Silver Ice of Alex Blandino for the Reds. Grant Holmes Draft Night Insert for the Dodgers. Uh, we did. Um, I'm trying to remember who we got, Sig. We got Refractors of Jonathan Holder for the Yankees and Byron Buxton for the Twins. I think it was actually uh, Forrest Wall is who we got. And it was a couple weeks ago. Yeah, we got one of the Bowman Black Purples out of 10. They're tough. Last pack of box number three has a green refractor in it. Got a dual insert of Sean Newcomb and Grant Holmes, Angels and Dodgers. And a green refractor of Lucas Sims for the Braves. That is number 47 of 150. Refractors were Dylan Seas for the Cubs and Ryan McMahon for the Rockies. That'll finish off the third box. We got one box left in the break. Get this card on a top loader here. There we go. All right. And last box.
Got a silver ice of Sean Newcomb for the Angels. Got a Michael Chavis draft night for the Red Sox and a base autograph behind it. Dylan Overton for the Oakland A's. Is the first autograph of box number four. Refractors are Jace Fry for the White Sox and Tyler Glass now for the Pirates. First autograph of box number four. Got Overton. You know who gets Overton? Yes, I do. Pack two. Got a silver ice of Carlos Correa for the Astros. And a die cut of Brian Johnson, not numbered for the Red Sox. Got a blue, huh? Yep. Freddie wanted you to get a blue of Kyle Schwarber, he said. Refractors are Grant Hawken for the Indians and Aaron Judge for the Yankees. <coughs> Got a Matt Olson insert for the A's. C.J. Edwards Mini for the Cubs. Refractors are Mitch Keller and Jacoby Jones for the Pittsburgh Pirates. The silver ice of Kyle Schwarber for the Cubs. Jacob Gatewood, draft night for the Brewers. Refractors are Ryan Castellani for the Rockies and Dominic Smith for the Mets. purple ice in this one. Got a dual insert of Michael Chavis and Michael Kopik for the Red Sox. Purple ice is for the Oakland A's, Matt Chapman. That is number 98 of 99. Refractors are Michael Geddes for the Padres and Brandon Nimmo for the Mets. Got a refractor auto in this pack. Silver Ice is Rise Hoskins for the Phillies. And the autograph is Dylan C's number two. This one is the refractor for the Cubs. Yuck. Refractors were Cameron Varga for the Rays and Luis Severino for the Yankees. Sita's a sixth round pick. 
Second auto of box number four, Refractor of Seas. Have half the box left. We got a red refractor. Really? It's nice. You got any autos left? I got one auto chance left. Reds are so tough. Good luck to everybody who's got a shot at the red. Red refractor. There is no ink. No ink. It's a good red, too. Oh, wow. It was a. Alex Jackson Conforto dual insert. That is good red. Texas Rangers hit the Joey Gallo Red Refractor. That is number two of five. It's definitely a Rangers group break, huh? Nice hit for the Rangers. Yeah, Gallo's a really good prospect. Yeah, he should be up soon. Very nice. Congrats. That's Alan. That is a good hit. I've noticed a lot of the uh, the reds that we've hit were off center, top to bottom. This one is the same. A little bit off. The centering in this entire issue is a challenge. And again, that was number two of five on the red. Still a good hit, though. Refractors were Josh Morgan for the Rangers and Miguel Almonte for the Royals. It's funny, I listed a Michael Sam autograph on eBay today. <laughs> it's already got a bid, too. Even the smaller names in that football stuff better. We got an insert of Chad Pender for the Oakland A's, a mini of Blake Sweetheart for the Red Sox. Refractors are Casey Soltis for the Marlins <laughs> and Gabriel Guerrero for the Mariners. How come he asked about DeWitt? Uh, I was talking about... Uh, Minor league teams in the area, and I don't know where DeWitt is. DeWitt is where my father grew up. How far away is it? It is uh, about 20 miles north of Davenport. So it's about an hour to an hour and a half away? Yeah. Nick Gordon, draft night insert. Trey Turner, Bowman is back for the Padres. Oh, yeah. That's where my uh, father grew up. My whole father's side is from DeWitt, Iowa. Refractors were Brett Austin and Courtney Hawkins for the White Sox. Not a big town. That's pretty crazy. We got Edmundo Sosa insert for the Cardinals. JP Crawford Mini for the Phillies. Fractors were Connor Joe for the Pirates and Braden Shipley for the Diamondbacks. <laughs> Two packs left in the break. Got a blue in this one. Got a shot at an auto here. Got a dual insert of Luke Weaver and Jack Flaherty for the Cardinals. Gareth Morgan, blue paper for the Mariners. And the blue refractor for the Texas Rangers, Jake Thompson, 36 of 399. Is it? Oh, it's not an auto. Okay. I was nope. Say. Not an auto. <laughs> it's been all Texas. That's crazy. Refractors are Sean Newcomb for the Angels and Jake Reed for the Twins. Last pack. <clears throat> Looks 
Looks like we just got a base auto on the last one. It's a redemption, oh, though. Oh, yeah, it's a redemption. Doesn't have to be base. Could say Super Fractor Aaron Nola. Cody Medeiros, Draft Night Insert. Barry be your friend forever if it said that, you know. Julio Urias, Bowman is back for the Dodgers. Redemption card. Bowman Chrome, Draft Pick Autograph. Just the base. Of Aaron Nola. It's a good card to end it on, though. Still a pretty decent hit, though. There's a Nola one more time. We'll finish out this pack and do a recap. Refractors were Luke Weaver for the Cardinals and Miguel Sano for the Twins. Good night, Jerry. Thanks, Thanks, man. Thanks, Jerry. All right, let's recap it. This is 2014 Bowman Draft Jumbo 4X Break number eight. Here's the highlight cards. We're just going to do uh, the parallels that were 99 or less and the other red ice we hit. Braxton Davidson red ice for the Braves out of 150. Matt Chapman purple ice for the A's out of 99. And an orange ice of Michael Feliz for the Astros out of 25. We hit one green refractor of Lucas Sims for the Braves out of 150. We hit one gold of Luke Weaver for the Cardinals out of 50. And one red refractor out of five. Number two of five of Joey Gallo for the Rangers. Autographs, we had base autos of Jeff Brigham for the Dodgers. Dylan Sees for the Cubs. Michael Geddes for the Padres, Forrest Wall for the Rockies, Jeff Hoffman for the Blue Jays, Jackson Reitz for the Nationals, Dylan Overton for the A's, Refractor Autos of Taekwon Forbes for the Rangers, and Dylan Sees for the Cubs. We hit uh, Redemption for an Aaron Nola base auto for the Phillies. We had two numbered autographs. We had a blue of Trey Supak for the Pittsburgh Pirates, number 38 of 150, and one green of Luis Ortiz for the Texas Rangers. That was number 29 of 99. Those were the highlight cards from the break. Thank you to everyone who helped us fill it out once again. Hope to see everyone next time. Be right back. I'm going to take this inventory.